I'm Damiana Garcia. I'm here at the 8th Annual Grilled Cheese Invitational in downtown Los Angeles. It's going to be a day of gooey, cheesy fun. Let's go. I have Miss Cheesy Grill here, exclusive. Tell me, Miss Cheesy Grill, how did you earn this title? Well, I enjoy cheese quite a bit. She made it up. <laughs> yeah. He will be competing in the competition. What's the winning recipe? What's what's your secret weapon? Lots of sugar sprinkled with a little bit of hope. It's the secret ingredient is a little bit of hope. That's what we need in these times. The oh. secret ingredient, everything is homemade. Oh. Homemade bread, homemade meatloaf, you know, and, then, and we do it all with love. That's the mo perhaps the most important ingredient of all. Now, here at the invitation, this year. They've got the Tillamook Baby Love Loaf Van. Bring in the love and bring in the cheese all across America. I'd love to take a little ride in the Love Loaf Van. I'd just be eating cubes of cheddar cheese all day long. We are giving out samples of Tillamook cheese. We have sharp and medium Tillamook cheese. You want to try some? I would love a cube. Sharp or medium? You know, I'm feeling sharp. I'm a little I can sharp. Tell. I can tell. She can tell I'm a sharp lady. Sharp lady reporter. My mouth is exploding with sharp, cheesy flavor. Yeah, that's right, because it's all natural. All natural cheese, as it should be. That's what we think. That's the way the big guy intended it. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Hey, this is the winning combo. Soup and cheese, tomato soup and cheese. cheese. Nothing better. Serendipity. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now here we have one of the grill-off competitions in progress. We're on the front lines now, where all the action's taking place. The teams are hard at work, and the excitement in the air is palpable. As palpable as a solid block of cheese. I see pom-poms flying, and spatulas grilling. Cheese is bubbling and smacking on the stove. Now this team's the cheese ballers, in the process of making their next grilled cheese. You're one of the cheese ballers, am I Right. I am the captain of the ship. What special ingredients are you going to be throwing in these sandwiches today? Well, let me let me tell you what's going on here. This is 12-year-old aged cheddar at $500 a pound. Buffalo cheese from the south of France with a little bit of truffle in it, about $800 a pound. And this, my friend, is gold. So what we do is we cook a Denny's Street equivalent $350 sandwich. We spray it down in lustrous arts and crafts edible gold. 24 karat grilled cheese. Exactly. I love it. I love it. That's brilliant. All right. Thank you so much. And you got your cheese bling right here. Loving that. This is iced out grilled cheese. So are you in competition today? Indeed I am. I'm looking for a championship here. I don't, I don't come all the way out here to lose. Hey, and I, I can tell you're in for the gold. That's a fact. I would say. We're doing a South Carolina grilled cheese with pecan crusted fried chicken and pimento cheese, fried green tomatoes on homemade cornmeal bread. It's my play on South Carolina. And you don't get more southern than fried green tomatoes. Exactly. Well, it's homemade cheddar bread, gouda cheese, American cheese, and barbecued macaroni and cheese. Fabulous! Mac and cheese in the cheese! That's the way to do it. Can I just tell you, there was one that was a Guinness braised short rib, the horseradish mayo, goat cheese, and all kinds of sexy deliciousness on, oh my god. Uh, it doesn't get cheesier than that. Cheesy par excellence. That's cheesy pride. That's cheesy pride for you. <laughs> this is actually a Swiss cheese fondue. Oh! Oh! oh. Ah! Ridiculous. This guy's just gotten his grilled cheese. Tell me about this sandwich you've just acquired. Well, it's called the Kulo Spanker, and I haven't tried it yet, but it looks delicious. Just a prediction, I think he's going to be enjoying it. Three, two, one. <laughs> and they're off. The Honey Pot Grilled Cheese Competition is underway. This is the Dessert Grilled Cheese Contest. We've got peanut butter cheese blend. It sounds weird, but it's great. A little chocolate ganache, a little sea salt, all on banana bread. What's going in your winning sandwich? It's a brioche cheese bread with butter sugar cheese and more butter sugar and cheese on top of it. We are making the original sandwich. We're using a very special Norwegian caramelized goat cheese called Ski Queen. It's like an empanada filled with apple and with the Ski Queen brown cheese. And it's the apple that gives it its namesake, I take it. And the sin, which goes into it. That's your special ingredient. Yes. yes. Uh, here we go. You'll see it first. Oh my god. Ecstasy. Damiana's living in ecstasy. Now this sandwich is the panty dropper. The panty dropper has mascarpone cheese, ice cream, candy pecans, hot fudge. There we go. Drizzle on that chocolate. And here we have the panty dropper. Toasted coconut to finish it off. It is a panty dropper. The panties are coming down. I got some sticky fingers. Oh, thank you, dear. Sure. No, no, no. Whatever I can do to help out. See, I got, I got to prepare myself for the next round. So the hand wipe is essential. Maybe yes. One more, maybe one. I, this is a, this is a two wiper. What do we have here? What, what, what is in this beautiful creation? Grilled Charlie. It's uh, peanut butter, but with jelly beans. Oh my goodness gracious! Peanut butter Charlie. <laughs> and interestingly, the jelly bean does clean the palate. I think I'll have another. 
We're making the Perry's Got the Blues sandwich. It's got vanilla pound cake, pear poured butter, toasted hazelnuts, homemade dulce de leche, and mascarpone and cambazola cheeses. This is called Perry's Got the Blues. I'm not singing the blues when I'm eating this. I'm walking on sunshine. It's called American is Apple Pie, and it's apple pie filling with brie cheese and an apple cider bourbon sauce drizzled on top. Now this is a premium sandwich. We got uh, pretty much pure decadence. We have glazed donuts, French toasted, extra sharp Wisconsin cheddar, bacon, drizzled with pancakes, cake syrup, a little powdered sugar, and garnish with a green apple. Oh, I think my heart just stopped for three beats, but it started again, and I'm enjoying. I heart cheese! Oh my goodness, banana leaves and cups and all sorts of accoutrement. Whoa, thank you, ma'am. Look at this, double fisting. My hands are full. I'm experiencing abundance, pure abundance. Now let me try that with a little bit of dipping sauce. I think with this one, the dipping sauce really makes the sandwich. You know what I loved about it? I love the dipping sauce. That was a fabulous addition to the whole experience. Deuce. Oh, I was dipping my sandwich in it. Oh, okay. That worked too. Okay. That worked too. Good for you. It's all about innovation today. Exactly. And sometimes the, the festival guests, we can add our own little input into it. Probably like you, dipping in melon juice. If it works, it works. Why not, right? Why not? Just do it. Just do it. Just, Just do it. it. Here they're cooking up some beauteous little banana bread cakes for their grilled cheese. <laughs> Here we go. The last grilled cheese of the day. A banana bread mascarpone. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want to try your hand at calling cheese. Now that's the capper. This is the capper. Now for the competitors, this is the most important part of the day. The ballot. In grading the sandwich, one must consider all of the salient factors. Taste, awesome or nasty. Enough cheese, too greasy. Is the flavor balanced? In the case of grilled Charlie, I'm going to say 20 out of 20. Uh, hello, ma'am. I'm ready to cast my vote. The Queen of Cheese will take care of this for you. Thank you. Thank you. Good eats. There's no turning back now. I've cast my vote. Okay, uh, let's see here. Uh, one, two, three. Now we're about to see the cheese call. This is where contestants have to call to the cheese. What a day. I've got a full belly and sticky fingers. But what a fabulous day it's been. A day full of gooey, yummy cheese. I'm Damiana Garcia. Sweet thing.